Hey, what's going on, everybody? This is Tyrone back with Tech Life. And as Verizon's consumer group slows down and the traffic is not where it used to be, they're going to be very selective in areas that they invest in and further strike agreements as to financial revenue growth for the company. So Verizon Business and VIT reach agreement for private 5G networking. So now they're going to attack the areas that they know they're very strong in. And one of those segments is business. They are very strong in business. And with the investments that they have made over the years, aggressively speaking, millimeter wave, mech, they can now provide these businesses with high, high amounts of bandwidth. So just speaking, uh, just read this uh, very briefly. The commercial on-site 5G sale brings 5G to the port of Virginia for high bandwidth, industrial uses, and secure day-to-day -day networking. That's where Verizon still knows they have the best perception. And they're going to start striking more and more of these networking deals on the 5G side. And that's why I was saying as Verizon notices, and they can notice this, they, they see it internally that the consumer traffic is very, very low. They're going to start shifting towards agreements like this even more aggressively. And that's where a good amount of the money that they make is going to come from and the growth moving forward. They're going to use the network investments over the years, the billions of dollars that they poured into the network to supply these businesses with the high bandwidth necessary for them to do the day-to-day -day operations or networking. Now, this is something that I find is a good thing, but they have to start, again, they have to start figuring out how to grow the consumer side. They're deploying the C-band spectrum that they spent 50 plus billion dollars on. Now they're spending 20 plus billion getting it out there at scale. They have to get the consumer back on board to come into those doors and they're not doing it. They haven't done any changes in a big way to make me say or think otherwise at this point in time. Could that change? Potentially it could, but for now, this is what I'm seeing. They're starting to do more business stuff now because they know that's where their perception is still at the top and they're striking these deals very, very early to keep from to keep AT&T and perhaps T-Mobile from getting these types of deals. So make sure you guys stay tuned to the channel, like, share, subscribe, follow my social media outlets. Tyrone with Tech Life. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.